Hello, motor test of the week time. This week I will be featuring a Turnergy, not focusing, 2826-6, 2200kV motor. It's one of the most popular motors. Um, got it on a Zippy 40C 3 cell, 2200. And prop I'm starting off with is an APC 6x4 electric prop. So let's see what we get on this. Thrust. What are we getting on here? So 26.8 amps, 319 watts. That's pretty good. Alright, I'll just change props. Okay, now I have swapped over to a TGS. 6x4 prop, still on the same setup. Uh, ESC is a Hobby King 50 amp ESC. Let's see what we get on the thrust on this prop. There's a bit more thrust than the APC. We got the one meter. Twenty-six point seven five three hundred seventeen watts. About the same, but got about was it about fifty grams more thrust there? That's pretty good. All right, try another prop. All right, this next prop I'm using. I don't know if it's going to be too much for it. It's a TGS 7x3. Uh, we'll try a 7x4, but I think it'll probably be way too much. So I've got a 7x3 on there. There might be a bit of a wobble on it, being a much bigger prop. But let's give it a go. Grams of thrust. Thirty-four point six amps, four hundred and four watts. That's not bad. It turns a seven by three. All right. Let's see what it does on a four cell. I've got the full cell on there using one of my 35C 2200 milliamp Hyperion full cells. Uh, first prop I'm going to try is a 5x5 TGS prop. Let's see what we get on the thrust on full cell. Funny noise. Thirty one amps. Four hundred and was that eighty two or ninety two? Four hundred and eighty two watts on the five by five. Yeah, it's not warm. That's pretty good. Key of the thrust there. Yeah, still the same. Right, let's try another prop. Okay, this one's probably going to overpower the motor a bit. 
but let's give it a go. It's back with the APC 6x4, still on the 4 cell. Let's give this a go. <laughs> A huge difference compared to the 5x5. Five five. What we got? Thirty-eight and a half amps, five hundred and eighty-one watts. Yeah, I've got it a little bit warm. Alright, let's try the TGS 6x4 again. I'll just whack that on. Alright, got the TGS 6x4 on. Let's see what the thrust difference is. Whoa! That was significant on the four cell. <laughs> they really do work well, these TGS props. 37 amps. 570 watts. What was the other one? Five. So yes, that is drawing less current and producing more thrust. That's pretty damn good. Try it again. That's alright. Yeah, it's still the same. Right. Uh, don't know what other props to try on that. I think that's probably good enough. Yeah, I think I'll probably run the 6x4 on there. Actually, I've got a 6x5. I'll try, I'll try the 6x5 on, see what that does. I've got a 6x5 TGS prop on there now, uh, which would be a bit better for speed rather than the 6x4. Um, see what thrust we get and see what power it pulls. Fresh, about 50 grams than the 6x4. See what the power difference is. Stop focusing. That's better. 34 amps, 513 watts. <laughs> Power's gone down, well. I haven't charged the battery in between, so it's probably gone down a little bit. So, to be honest, there probably won't be much difference in the 6x4 in uh, power. So you can run a 6x5 TGS prop and get more thrust than the APC 6x4. Fifty two hundred grams of thrust or something. Yeah, it's better so. I haven't charged the battery in between, but it's not that hot either. Let's see what we get on the temps. If I can get a good reading. Come on. What's that? Thirty nine point four. I think it went up to forty at one point there. I can't really get a good reading on it. Yeah, it's like thirty nine forty degrees. 
so not too bad. Yeah, so that's pretty good. So that will run a 6x5 TGS on 4 cell with 1400 grams of thrust. Right, that'll do it on this motor, I think. That was motor test of the week. If you want to see more of these motor tests, which I'll be doing every week, click like and subscribe. See you later.